What is going on you guys? I'm Mike of Anabolic Aliens and today I got you another static stretching video and we're going to cool down our legs. But real quick before we get into this routine, make sure to download my workout app called Exercise. It is a free download. It can literally generate you thousands of workouts based off your customized selections. So make sure you check it out. But let's not waste any more time guys and hop into this routine. I know you're trying to cool down. So each stretch is going to be 30 seconds long to maximize the effectiveness. Guys, if you don't static stretch, I know this is a little different content for my channel, but if you don't static stretch, make it a point to start doing so. There are so many benefits behind it. And one is decreasing that delayed onset muscle soreness. I know you guys don't want to be limping the next day or not able to walk. And it also helps with recovery. So you can hit your workout even harder the next day. Whew. Let's get into this stretch, guys. It's going to be 10 stretches. I know there are thousands of stretches you can do, but this is just a simple follow along routine so you can maximize the effectiveness in just five minutes and hit the entire leg. So all the leg muscles will be cooled down. Whew. We're going to start standing up with the right standing quad tuck. In three, two, one, Bring that leg up and really balance, guys. If you have trouble balancing, hold on to the wall, a bar, or whatever you can to add stability because you're focusing on the quad, not trying to balance yourself. But if you, need, if you do have the stability, you can pretend you're holding onto a bar. I know that helps a lot of people. And if you don't need to, just really focus on getting deep into that quad stretch. Keep breathing. In your nose, out your mouth, guys. Switch. I'm telling you guys, I know a lot of people who have stability issues and they literally pretend they're holding on to a bar and it helps them stabilize. But like I said, I'd rather you hold, actually hold on to something and focus on stretching out that quad because that's the purpose of this stretch. Three more seconds. Now a right standing calf. Bend the left knee a little bit, grab the right toe, and pull upward, guys. So this knee is bent, this knee is straight, and you're pulling upward on the toe. This stretches out that calf. Try and straighten out that back, guys. You can balance your other, other arm on that other knee. Switch sides, guys. Bend that right knee now, lift that left toe. The higher you lift that toe, the more that calf you're gonna stretch out. Keep breathing, guys. Very important during the cool down. You want your heart rate to come back down. Three more seconds. Going to a right hip forward. So lean the hip forward, and if you want to intensify the stretch even more, maximize the actual stretch, you can lift that back leg up. You should be able to see your back toe and then push forward, guys. That back leg should be straight, you should be able to see your back toe, and the front knee should be behind, should be behind the front toe. The further you lean forward, the more that hip you're going to stretch out. Switch. Keep breathing, guys. Let your body cool down. We're stretching out every leg muscle. Three more seconds. On your butt and tuck the leg. Now, since we're focusing pretty sore, strictly on legs, that's the reason I'm not twisting. If you have any lower back pain or stress, you can add that twist just like this. But I'm just focusing on stretching out the IT band and the glutes. Switch. Keep breathing, guys. Tuck that knee in as far as you can. Now 
know, spread the legs, guys. Clearly, this thing was for show. We didn't even use it. So, spread the legs and go all the way to the right. Keep both legs on the ground, guys. Point the toes upward. Reach as far as you can. Pull on that foot if you can reach to get even further. Two more seconds. Switch it over, guys. Make sure both legs are on the ground, guys. The toes are still pointing up. And reach. This is the last stretch of the routine, guys. Five more seconds. Relax, guys. So, we just start with a quad stretch, we go into a calf stretch, then do a hip stretch, then do a glute and IT band stretch, and then end with a hamstring stretch. So we just went through all the leg muscles, guys. And like I said in the beginning, I know there are a ton more leg stretches you can do, but this is a simple routine to minimize the time you're doing it, but maximize the effectiveness of each stretch for each leg muscle. So guys, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, and I will be covering all the muscle groups of the static stretching series. Like I said, again, I know it's different than my normal content, but it's something I find very important, and I wanna help you guys, because I know a lot of you don't do it. I personally am a victim of not doing it myself too many times, so I'm making my focus of doing it more myself, so I hope you guys can do it with me and make it a focus for you and really reap all the benefits static stretching has. This is to be done after your workouts, guys. Make sure to hit that thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button, notification bell, so you never miss a new video upload from me. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.